Hey y'all, it's your girl here, it's Janae. I am back with another video. So as you see, I have an afro here, so it is a bit dry. So I'm gonna go ahead and try out the Kaleidoscope Hair Products So Fed Collection. I've been wanting to try out this collection for a while, so I'm glad I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all how it actually works in my hair. So as you see, I am applying their MAC and Clean Sulfate Free Shampoo. It does contain coconut milk, vitamin A, and also vitamin B12 in it. It left my hair feeling really soft, and also it did not strip my hair from its natural oils, which is a plus. So I'm gonna go ahead and deep condition my hair using their Cranberry Deep Conditioner. Because I have high porosity hair, thick base products normally work really well with my hair. So as you see, I'm definitely digging it and the smell is amazing, y'all. <laughs> As I apply the deep conditioner on there, I also make sure I finger detangle just to get all the tangles out and then I just follow up with my wide tooth comb. I really just work in sections until all of this is complete. So after I applied it in, I rinsed it out, and then this is how it looked. It felt so, so soft, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead and use the Marshmallow Leaf in Conditioner. So it does have marshmallow root extract and also sweet almond oil, and y'all, it smells amazing. I had to look at the bottle and give a little double take, but it is amazing, y'all. It applied really, really well. I just applied it all throughout my hair, and I love that it, you can also detangle with this, and it also helps promote growth. <laughs> So what I'm doing is the lock method. So what I'm applying next is the Pecan Pie Growth Booster Oil. So I like to apply my leave-in, my oil, then I apply my styling mask. So right here, I'm just applying the oil throughout all of my strands to seal it in. And I'm just splitting my hair into four sections so I can go ahead and do my twist out. Like I always do, I start from the back first. So I'm just using my little comb to make my section. And then I'm going to be applying the Peach Cobbler Gel Styler, y'all. As you see, it's thick base, but also it feels amazing going into my strands. It made my hair feel really smooth. And it also defined my curls really, really well. With the mixture between the leave-in condition and also this gel, a little did go a long way. So I did not have to use a lot of gel. And it made my curls really, really defined, as you'll see at the end. But also, I'm going to go ahead and show y'all that I am twisting it in two strand twists. And then when I get to the end, I just twirl it like that. And I just keep continuing the process until it's all done. Right here, I'm just showing y'all a close-up of how the curls look. As you see, it really, really defined it well. So I am definitely interested in doing a wash and go with this as well. So stay tuned. But anyways, I am basically done doing my two-strand twist. This is how it's looking. I did sit under my hooded dryer for about an hour and a half. And then also, I slept in it overnight to give it, you know, the rest of the time to dry. But this is how I look with it all in. And then I just went ahead and put my hair into a ponytail. I put some oil on my hands. And I'm just going to unravel all of the twists.
I tell y'all, this is super defined. Like, it is super defined. As you see, like, ooh, y'all. Like, it is wavy. There is no frizz. And, yeah, I was kind of like, do I want to separate the curls? But I ended up doing it just to give it some volume. And as you see, I missed a piece right there. But, yeah, I went ahead and separated the curls to give it a little bit of volume. But I still had the frizz-free hair and also, you know, some voluptuous curls. I am in love with my hair, y'all. So, if you want more information on everything that is listed in this video, please go ahead and check out my description box as I have more information. Thank you for watching and love y'all. Bye.